While many are focused on whether the Zika virus and political instability will affect the Olympics in Rio, some locals have more pressing concerns, being evicted from their homes. Rio's mayor reportedly ordered residents be removed from 14 of the city's favelas, or urban shanty towns, in preparation for the 2016 Olympic Games. One favela, called Villa Atodromo, has drawn attention for its resistance to the eviction orders. Fishermen and construction workers illegally settled in Villa Atodromo in the 60s and 70s. The community was later legally recognized and, until the start of Olympic construction, was home to around 600 families. One resident told The Guardian, I feel totally excluded. The Olympics has just brought the destruction of my home. The stress has made me sick. While the mayor has defended the sometimes forceful evictions, offering buyouts and alternative housing options, some favela residents fear the Olympics were used as an excuse to just oust them from their homes. According to The Guardian, major local landowners have shown interest in the past in developing the land, quote, for the elite. Rio on Watch, a program created to magnify favela residents' voices, reports 75% of the 16,700 relocations in Rio in the past several years have been linked to the World Cup and the Olympics. For Newsy, I'm Eugene Daniels.